guys, what's up? Hi, Optical. Hi, BJ. Probably dark. Hi, dark. I don't even see dark, and I assume dark's here. How you guys doing? We have, we have our hey emote. Yo, Canisha and Derek, thank you for the sub gift. Yo, everybody, I need everybody to hug Canisha right now. Please love. Hi, comic. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you so much for the resub, optical. My God. No, fuck social distancing. You need a hug. Hi, Baker. Baker's here too. Oh my God, is today my day? Hi, Thunder. No dessert destruction, but we're trying pasta again. We're trying it again. So, just gotta keep trying. It's been nine months. Good grief, comic. Hi, Dark. Yeah, we can virtual hug. I'll just approach you like this and, you know. I got Olive Garden on style. Look, if if it goes to hell, I have backup noodles. So it's fine. Yeah, that's true, same. Anybody else like in need of like a real hug right now? Hi, Carissa, how are you? I like just looked at your Instagram story right before I started the stream, actually. That's funny. <clears throat> Stop what? Stop what, Axel? Thank you, Dark. Ninja got me, I, I need your opinion. Ninja got me these like leather pants. <laughs> I feel like I should be in Greece, but I'm into them. Hi, Bobo. My brain can't. I don't like to think about how long some people have been here because I realize it's like <gasps> Derek, thank you for the sub gift to Carissa. My God, Derek, you gotta stop it, all right? Put it toward the PC fund. Hi, Shouser. What do you mean they're fit for stream? What's wrong? What's wrong with them? They're very hot. No. Not giving up, Derek. We got stuff we can send you. You're supposed to talk to Ninja about it. Wait, what about Valorant comp? Something, I haven't even been playing Valorant, so. Whatever, broski. All right, so today we're doing, um, I'm making these like shrimp sushi poke bowls for my lunches this week. And we're gonna have lemon piccata, or sorry, tilapia piccata. <laughs> I don't know why I said lemon piccata. Tilapia piccata. Oh, interesting. I look different? Is it the ponytail? Probably, I don't wear my hair in a ponytail very often. So. I'm trying to wear it while I'm cooking because I shed hair like a feral cat. I don't, so. You know, we're going for like sanitary, hygienic cooking today. No hair, hopefully. Wow, <laughs> I swear. They got wet food today, so they're probably sleeping. Neither of them can use it. Look, you can see it over there. All right. I'm gonna get started on the pasta because it's gonna have to rest for a little bit. So, I'm following this recipe to eat. I don't wanna fuck it up. Probably end up with a lot more dough than necessary, but I don't care. I don't care. I'm just gonna do it like it says. I'm not gonna try to half it. I'm not gonna try to do anything. All right, we're gonna do, uh, we're gonna do a blend of flour. This is up to my discretion, apparently. But, 
I have all purpose and I have semolina, which semolina is pasta flour. So we're doing a half and half kind of situation. So we're gonna do a cup and a quarter of each of these. I learned something recently and I'd like to share it with you. You're not supposed to scoop flour like you're supposed to spoon it in and not flatten it. This is news to me. It makes for proper measuring. But who knows? Maybe this is what I've been missing. I'm just, I'm spooning it in. Apparently this is really important if you're not cooking by weight. Yeah, I, I had no idea. All right, quick guys, while I'm spooning. Big spoon or little spoon? All right. Cup and a quarter, like that. Here's my other. Big. Yeah, I agree. I like both at different times, but I think I prefer to be the big spoon. I sleep better as the big spoon. Tried last night and then ordered a shit ton of I'm glad you ordered food. What did you get? What was your, what's your like sorrow meal? I feel like everybody has a depression meal. I don't think this really matters so much. Very fun. Semolina flour is very fun. All right. I'm going with this one. All right, we have our flour. I'm gonna do a little bit of pre-incorporation because I don't know, I'm very nervous. I'd like to do this right today. I want proper pasta today and I'm making in the stand mixer. I'm not doing it by hand because I've tried to make it by hand several times and it doesn't turn out and I, I don't really know why that is. But I got Asian food. <laughs> Wow, very true to your name. Great. All right. Add all ingredients, bowl of a stand mixer. I'm just adding it all in. Four eggs. Four eggs. Room temp. They're a little cold. They've been out for like two hours, but they're cold. That's fine. Nothing I can do about it now. I'm gonna make, I'm gonna make like a fake well, sort of mini well. That's what you would do. So, I know that much. Have Ninja help you out. Four. This is already not stressing me out as much because normally like handmade pasta, you just have to like pile it all up on the counter and like mix it with your hands and it's so messy and stressful. I just I'm not I'm not about it today. What's their warranty? All right, what else? A tablespoon of olive oil and a teaspoon of sea salt. We're using kosher salt because that's what we have. You can suck at pasta if you don't like it. We're not guessing anywhere. We're doing proper measurements. I'm not eyeballing anything on this. Teaspoon of salt. And 
tablespoon of olive oil. Now I have my pasta make, or sorry, my stand mixer, no hook attachment, and I'm just gonna need this. I'm gonna fix it. I'll plug it in first. Start slow. Yeah, you, if you're spending good money on a PC, you shouldn't have to have any fibers. I feel like at least. <sighs> All right. I'm gonna help it along a little bit and create the sides. too high. Maybe I'll turn up to medium just for a second just to let it all get you guys tell I'm very worried and stressed out about this pasta. It's not supposed to be that hard. Like it's not supposed to be one of those things that is like impossible next level is hard to do. Like I've made soufflés, I've done all kinds of shit. Macar macarons I've made plenty of times like Pasta is my nemesis for some reason. I don't understand why I struggle with it so much. But today is the day. Hi, Blow. Hi, Foam Maker. And tree level. I hate when I need like something that'll like make it stick. Oh, I guess well, I need to lock it. Lock it so it doesn't like lift up. Electronic trash can. broken up. I think it's fine, but and I just don't, I don't want to mess this up. I'm going to make sure it's like what it needs to do. <laughs> Spit in it. Hi, Raga. What the heck are you talking about? It's dry. Did I add water in my last attempts with this? I can't remember. Well, now my timer's. Alexa, cancel the timer. Six minutes for cancel. Yes! 
Good, Derek, good. Eat that fucking poutine. You deserve it. You deserve a bathtub full of poutine, if that's what you wanted. Ben's Gary, thank you for the follow. All right. I think maybe in my last attempts, I wasn't kneading it enough. Because you gotta knead it to like develop like the poutine or whatever. Alexa, set a timer for six minutes. on the internet before, please. Just please. Bro, my PC is a monster right now. It just makes me so happy. That's the thing. I literally just broke my most recent phone by dropping it in the pool. And it wasn't even, it was like less water than what I just did. And <laughs> it broke. So it's not supposed to. They're supposed to be water resistant, but, which is why I had it near the pool to begin with. Like I didn't have it in the pool, but I had it like on the side. I'm still waiting on my case for it to come in. I don't even have a case yet. Alright. Crisis. Today's crisis has been... has occurred. I don't know, man. That's what I'm saying. I've, I've actually accidentally 
usually dropped it in water for like a second before because I like to have my phone in the bathtub with me. <laughs> so I dropped it and it was fine. I wasn't, nothing happened. But now I'm like paranoid after that. I don't know, it could have been, it could have been a number of things. Alright, I'm making sure that the water, it's not clear yet. I want the water to be super clear on this to rinse off all the starch. if I'm actually just cooking for me in my house, I'm probably wearing two pants and no bra, but how long did you take you to get in? Uh, not long. They're not, they're not like real leather. They're like stretchy, like pleather. Why do you want me to put full hour on my pants, sir? Hi Merlot, thank you outside my normal fashion, I gotta say. Oh, they sell the cups. It's very nice. I love the drink drawer. Or it's like a flex drawer, so it like you can change the temperature on it and keep like whatever you want in it. For us it's like drinks and beer and stuff. But you can keep like your meats. I think I'm gonna I don't know. Um I'm gonna pull out out of the way. Still works. It says if the dough seems wet or sticky, it wants to be pretty dry. Not wet, it's not sticky. Form the dough into a ball with your hands and wrap it tightly with plastic wrap. We're gonna do it. <laughs> Has anybody here made fresh pasta? Fo, have you made fresh pasta before? I need, I need like, encouragement. Yeah, I was gonna do cod today instead of tilapia, but the cod was like really expensive. I did, it was like $17 a pound or something. I was like, mm, not today. got press and seal because that is the only cling wrap, saran wrap, whatever to buy. Literally don't buy anything else. Not worth it. Thank you, Lagoon. They call me official pasta at work. Hi, Daniel. Hi, Hinka. Guys. <laughs> hey. <laughs> so much. Would you really, do you really want to wake Nina up? Hi, Strikes! Thank you for the three month resub! Thank you! 
How you doing, Strikes? We have music on, don't we? You guys hear the music? You gotta show the pasta who's boss. All right, this is, this is the pasta. I'm gonna stop fiddling with it. I'm gonna stop slapping it. I'm gonna... It's a nice little ball, though. It's got little creases in it, and I think that's... It doesn't have to be, like, perfectly smooth, does it? No, how do you know? You see, I've seen the Food Network. I know what to do. You can't hear it, Ninja, but that's what he's saying. All right. Flinch, thank you for the follow. All right, we got a tight wrap on this puppy. Devil, thank you for the follow. All right, Alexa, set a timer for 30 minutes. Starting now. Nice. What? Excuse me? Please. We don't have tarantulas here. Right. Oh, hydration time. Hmm. What'd you guys eat today? Anything equally delicious as this? Hopefully. We'll see. I'm so nervous. I want it to work. Really want. All right, this is gonna be used for later. So I'm just gonna put this over here. As you can see, I've whipped out my pasta attachments. I have my roller and I have my cutter. This is a spaghetti with cutter. It even says spaghetti. We chuck it at the wall. That's not true. That's not true. Cooking pasta and testing it by throwing it at the wall is a myth. Don't do that. Sounds good, guys. What kind of potatoes? The fuck? Y'all think I'm about to get got by spider jokes. All right. Our water is sufficiently clear. I've rinsed two cups of brown rice. I have sushi rice in my pantry, but it's not as good for me. So. What the fuck kind of what the fuck kind of potato is that? My heathen for not knowing that. These emotes fly. Yeah, no, literally never heard of them in my life. Sounds like a, maybe a British thing. All right, it's two cups of water to one cup of rice. That's what we're doing. Could have just pulled out my other measuring cup, but now I'm, I'm here now, so I'm gonna do this the hard way. Drags out time. Right. I'm not gonna salt it. Hopefully, I would. It doesn't say on the recipe. And again, I'm trying to achieve like the stickiest texture I can with this. But it says. I'll salt it, fuck it. No butter though. If I was doing this like for a normal side dish, I would add like a pat of butter in there, but that will make it separate, certainly. All right, let's go ahead, get this on. Turn on high. Now let's handle our shrimp. That was loud. I apologize. <laughs> no. Oh yeah, au gratin. Au gratin potatoes. Yeah, those are delicious. 
In the UK, we call them tags. All right, I'm making about a package and a half of these. Dolphin. Imagine calling them dolphin potatoes. I think I'm just gonna like. I'm just gonna put. Are these peeled? No, they're. Okay, we gotta peel them. That's fine. So. Nah, I ain't careful with knives. Alright, that's good. Hinks, thank you for the follow. I said I called you Hinka. My apologies. That was not right. But I can't read. Alright, so obviously fresh is better, but it's actually really hard to find fresh like seafood right now for some reason. So frozen it is. So we're just gonna run it under cold water for a few minutes, let that go. And then in the meantime. Let's get our other thing. Yo, they gave me a honking cucumber. I wasn't ready for it. I wasn't ready. It's so long. It's the biggest, it's the biggest cucumber I've ever seen. Please calm down, Officer. Welp. <laughs> I, I'm so glad that this is wrapped in plastic to really add to the effect right now. I, you know what annoys me though, for real, real talk? The fact that, like, we use so much plastic that, like, they're wrapping this in plastic. It doesn't need it. Like, why? Really? Oh, my God. Oh. Intense. Should we peel it? No, we're not going to peel it. Skin on, as they say. Um... Yeah, Disney does have big ones. Kind of shaking up the shrimp every once in a while to get thawing. I mean, that big, I find them kind of fibrous. Just goes to show you, bigger ain't always better, guys. Should I slice them? Should I dice them? Wait one second, right. Uh, says one cucumber diced. Alright, so here's what I do. because otherwise it's just gonna rot in my fridge. So, peel or no peel? Help me, I don't know, I can't decide. I don't wanna throw it against the wall. Peel, all right, we're peeling it. Peeling it. So I can find my peeler. I need to clear out, I need to clean my drawer. I 
Maybe I'm just looking over it. It's an idiot. I don't know. My peeler. Do you hear this? Or did it, did it break? I don't know. I need your functional eyes, apparently. I've always wanted to do like a fruit ninja situation, Merlo. Don't say that to me. Didn't even phase him. He's a real man. <laughs> what are you doing? I don't know. What would you have done with it? I don't know. I have no idea. I guess I can still peel it. Wow. Oh, wait! Where did this come from? Have you literally been holding it this whole time? <laughs> I don't know! What the fuck? You just started peeling it? I was like, I'm gonna it. peel it! I'm gonna peel it while I wait for the for the rest of the day. Guys, do you guys know why I hate TikTok? Another reason why I hate TikTok. Did you guys hear? There's a new trend where men are claiming that they can taste soy sauce with their testicles. Did you know that? Well, yeah, you gotta use a peeler. If you're using, if I were to use a knife, Slim, like, yeah, half the cucumber would be gone. Okay. Yes. Apparently, testes, your testes, have taste buds. But number one is your testes. So claiming that you can dip your balls in soy sauce and taste it is like rubbing soy sauce on your cheek and claiming that you can taste it. <laughs> Fuck, dude. I hate people. Yeah, please. Please don't. Oh, that's boiling. We got distracted by the peeler fiasco and now. Fuck. article about it. I don't need to see videos. We're gonna... It's, it's Foe's it's Fo Maker's favorite part of the cooking show. satisfying. Nice. 
<laughs> We're gonna make nice little bowls of our stuff. I mean, why do I need a separate knife? Here we, oh, I didn't. I didn't do paper cuts, but I I should. We have. Do we have some like junk mail? Let's see if we could do it. Bowmaker sent me a video that this morning or yesterday cutting through paper and it was just like the most satisfying thing ever. So satisfying. I love cucumber. Some people don't like cucumber, but I love it, which is like a little bit of salt. So good. Cucumber and cream cheese sandwiches are also where it's at. Yeah, no, this is, this is my main knife. This, this is my proper chef's knife. This is what I was using a while ago, but I, I really just kind of use this one for like cutting open bags and like boxes and just like little dumb shit, um, which I had this open for, to open up a couple bags. And then I have my petty knife that Faux Maker gave me is for like finer work. And then I have a bread knife. Like it's a shitty bread knife, but. I rarely like cut bread, so it's not really an issue. It does make a difference. It's very important. I just did just sharpen my knife. It's very nice. A knife for everything and a thing for every. Maker is a knife enthusiast. We're gonna keep an eye on our rights, but for now we're getting ready. Alexa, how much time is left? 15 minutes. We're gonna try this. Or we're gonna try to time this. Right. All right, we have a bowl of cucumber. Lovely. Boning knife. I do have a little fillet knife. That's true. But I rarely use it. So. Alright, let's get some carrots out. We're keeping these carrots raw. specific way like either sushi or sashimi or I don't know like very very seasoned I hate bland fish and I find that fish tends to be you know what I mean stuff is very satisfying. The carrot was ugly. Now it's pretty. The question is like once my pasta is done resting, how long can I let it sit? Like once I cut it, can I just like leave it? So I'm ready for to cook it. Timing on it. I really want to 
do this right today. Like, I'm so hopeful. Hi, Yui. What's good? I'll call the carrot ugly if I want to. It's ugly carrot. How are we preparing these carrots? Get your first home cooked meal. Oh, that's so exciting. I'm sure it'll be delicious. Oh, we're grating these carrots, by the way. So interesting. <laughs> How do I grate them? We'll just be like. That's the spot. All right. I'm gonna cut the little nubbins off. Compost. I don't compost. I should. I should compost. But I don't. I have a compost situation here. Go for it. A lot of farmers. You know, Faux Maker informed me. Um, you hear that all the time that like people don't eat like fruit unless they're fruit or vegetables unless it's like good looking. So like a lot of ugly fruit gets wasted. Apparently that gets used. Are you trying to ask me a statistics question, bruh? Please. I took statistics in college. I got a B. That was like. Oh, like eight years ago? Heck, heck is statistics. Alright, we're gonna grate these. Are there rice done? There. Actually. Probably not. They'll turn the heat off. Alright, let's get the grater out. <laughs> I'll use the big one. baby food because ninja and i had baby food like maybe six months ago for one of those streams it's disgusting baby food is so gross you wouldn't think it's that bad but it's gross cooking naked is dangerous brian you shouldn't you shouldn't be with a woman who cooks naked because that shows that she's reckless I can cook just as well as some of those people on the Food Network. I guess it depends on what you're making. Because if you're frying something, splatter is real. Dude, if you get oil splatter on your titty, that's not cool. Always be fully clothed in the kitchen. This is Sunshine's cooking tip of the day. I've actually, uh, like, I've worn like a like a like a tank top, like a low cut tank top, cooking or frying, and I've gotten burned like up here before. It's dangerous. I have a scar right here um, from like being a teenager and baking, and I had like a little crop top on or something. And I pulled cookies out of the oven, and the pan like touched my lower stomach. It fucked me up. Lovely carrots. I think I don't really need this that many. Well, carrots are good for you. And this is for my meal prep, so. I do. <laughs> I've never, okay, legit though, I've never cooked naked. That's, that's a fact. 
No. I mean, I'm sure I've like microwaved something naked, like late night, wanting to microwave some shit or whatever, but I've never like properly cooked naked. I actually don't walk around my house naked. I don't, I'm not like comfortable doing that. I don't like to. Microwave. <laughs> I don't know, bro. Have one from last where I burn my ooh, ouch. Do people actually walk around their house just completely butt naked though? I mean, come on. Like just on the reg. Just like chilling, sitting on your couch naked. People don't do that, do they? I don't like it either. I agree. I feel exposed. In the morning. Yeah, that's true. You've started wearing your robe. Oh. Hi, gamer. Do we need carrots? I'll do one more carrot. Thank you, Raz. Ooh. You know, I can't see you, but I bet you look good today, too. The ponytail is practical, bruh. I'm really not a fan of tilapia, actually, Brian, but cooked in this way, it's good. I said earlier I was gonna do cod for this, but it was, I, I was ordering groceries and it was like the only option for fresh cod was like $17 a pound, so I wasn't about it. A pound of tilapia, which might be too much, but thank you, gamer. How are you today? What games have you been playing lately, gamer? Whew. Cod is, I've really, you know, I think I've only ever really had cod like fried because cod is typically what they use in like fish and chips. Stuff like that, or like a fried cod sandwich. I don't know if I've ever had it. Um, $250 worth of groceries. Do you shop like per week, per month? I shop weekly. You spend about like $100 a week on Not bad. What's your favorite kind of fish, phone maker, and everybody? All right, I think probably enough carrots. I got it here. Just do it. Two weeks. Well, you you get a lot of like high quality meat and stuff. One K on groceries. My God, you're a halibut guy. Oh, for fish and chips. I don't know, this this particular recipe is like a creamy piccata. Normally I make like a, just a like wine and lemon juice based piccata. But this recipe had cream sauce kind of and cod. Tilapia is very light, that's true. But I, I think it's very delicate, but it's good for this. This <laughs> sounds good, Bobo. Careful not to grate your finger, like I sometimes do. Anybody else meal prep? Cause damn. I do halibut or mahi for piccata. Redfish. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not like a fish. I'm not an aficionado. <laughs> so, um, <laughs> I don't have an opinion. <laughs> Yeah, I've had, I think I have had swordfish. It's very, I remember it being dry. I think, I'm thinking of like Isla Mirada something, but. I like mahi. I think if I'm going to a restaurant and they have fish, I'm probably gonna lean toward like blackened mahi. Otherwise, I don't really know. All right, 
We have our cucumbers and our carrots. We have our rice. Check to see how that's going. Alexa, how much time is left? Who's left? All right, that's good. We we did achieve a pretty fluffy rice, so that's good. I'm gonna let this cool for a little bit before I start mixing anything in with it. I do also need to cook shrimp. I think, how should I cook the shrimp? Should I, should I just boil them? Should I, cook them off in their shells and then peel them? Or should I peel them then? We're not really, I'm leaning toward like cooking them in their shells. Alexa, stop. Hmm. It doesn't actually say in the recipe how to cook them. Cook the shrimp. But I didn't buy pre-cooked shrimp because I don't like to do that. They're kind of nasty, I find. Ooh, I love Love a good tuna steak. Mm, yeah, we don't have Costco. No Costco, we have a BJ's, which I think is comparable. I don't know. All right, pasta's been resting for half an hour. Let's, let's work with this. Let's see how we do this. So, I need emotional support right now. Please and thank you. All right. Roll up pasta dough into your desired shape. And say if you can. All right, we'll just wait. We'll, I'll put it in the fridge. Says. I'll pull it out. Okay, a few more minutes won't hurt it at room time. I've decided that's what we're doing. We're gonna cook our shrimp. So, I'm cooking the shrimp in the shells, and then I'll peel them. For like. You're right, I need to stay hydrated. Oh yeah. Instacart is life. I think all of our all of our Instacart places are dollar Actually Publix might be cheap. I don't know. I usually get two orders. Yeah, I get two orders. I get um one from Aldi for like my staples, and then Publix for everything else. That Aldi doesn't have. Aldi doesn't have a huge selection of stuff. My only other issue is with Aldi is that you can't just buy like one onion. You have to buy like a bag of them. Sometimes I don't want to buy a bag of onions. I just want one onion, or something. get in trouble. Shrimp cook very quickly. Don't need to go crazy. You want to keep an eye on them. I mean, okay. Basically, you're just going to want them to like all turn. I'm not doing anything out of the, out of the Good and simple. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> All 
All right, so do I need to, you know, this, this tutorial is not very, not very specific and it's stressing me out. Okay, here, no, 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 here, I, I got it, I got it. I got it. roll fresh pasta, all right. Lightly flowering pasta as you go. That's sticking. All right. Let's try this. It looks good. I mean, it doesn't look as horrible as it has in the past. the action. Pasta action. It's not sticky at all. So I'm happy about that. Massive cheese ball. Dude, I not gonna lie, a cheese ball sounds so good. I think I'm becoming lactose intolerant though. Cause I get heartburn constantly and I don't know if it's dairy or what. Like, it's not even that I've like eaten anything like crazy like fattening or anything. Like I had coffee this morning and I got crazy heartburn. Maybe, I don't know. It's frustrating me. All right, so first we have a roller attachment, which I'm gonna put on right now. Thanks, Garusa. Get, get in there, get in there. Screw that in. All right, we're gonna start, we're starting the widest setting. Oh, no, that's the widest setting. Then I guess we slowly go Wait, who am I ignoring? I'm, I'm so confused. I don't know. All right, whatever. <laughs> Get ignored. Huh? Oh, right. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> promise. I promise tonight. The, the problem is I, I get used to what I tell people when they win to message me on Discord, and then after the stream I see it, and then I send it, but you didn't message me, so I forgot. That's why I tell people to do that, because I will forget. Desired thinness, it doesn't, I don't know. What's my desired thinness? We'll see. All right. Huh? Why? Huh? Doesn't really matter. I need to tell me what to do. Off there, come on. There, are you pleased? You happy now? I know we have to fold it into a letter. Go a little thinner. Nope, that, nope, 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 it's not the way, it's not the way. Huh? That's not what a player does. 
Do I not need to fold it into letters? Yeah, you fold it, but keep it on the widest side. Man! Hold it, you. I don't know, man. That's what I just thought I saw people do. Alright. Fill the widest. And then you're out here telling me what to do. Alright. What am I doing wrong? <laughs> what am I doing wrong? Let me make it smaller. Well, it's all broken up. It's not like a nice. Huh? It's not. What do you mean, my dough? It's. I'm, I'm starting over. Do it one more time on three. Spam, spam emotional support. Emotional support! I'm gonna dust it with flour before I cut it. The girl is stressed! I'm gonna dust you can make it into a little mess. Shouting, I'm freaking. Yeah, your water ready to cook it? Not yet. It's fine. You can you don't have to you don't have to cook it immediately. You don't have to cook it immediately. Hi Sin! I'm dusting it with lots of flour. I will, I will. Oh my god, guys. Okay. Okay. Okay.
Stop screaming at me. It's very difficult. Okay. We've got our first mound of spaghetti. We need massaging pasta. What are you talking about? We have pasta that's cut and it does not look sticky. I'm really flouring it because I, I really don't want it to stick. I'm about to be so happy if this works. You have no idea. Paschetti. All right, we gotta repeat the process. We have little nests. We can do it again, right? 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 Right. It's spaghetti, all right? It says spaghetti on the attachment, all right? <laughs> What's big words? All right, one more time. One second. Are you guys as hyped for the spaghetti as I am? Talking to the noodle lady. <laughs> Don't call me a noodle lady. Kidding, you can call me a noodle lady. Because noodle lady would imply that I know how to make fresh pasta. Which? Dude, Sin, this is about the fifth time I've tried to make fresh pasta and it has failed. And this is the closest I've gotten. So yeah, I'm hype. All right, so get hype with me. Might be, I don't know what it is about this particular blob, but it's not doing it. So we're gonna try another part. Maybe because I like worked it too much. Noodle queen. Yes. Call me the noodle queen. How are you, DRM? I hope you're as feeling as wonderful as you are. Am I on some sugar? No, I'm not on sugar. I'm just on that anxiety high, you know? All right, let's... That's okay, that's okay. We're gonna... We're gonna envelope it and then do it again. That's what we did last time and it fixed it. Discovered that three is the All right, I gotta be ready. I gotta be ready to put this down again. Guys, it's working. I think, I really think it's working. Three is the key. Three was the right thickness. Dusting with flour. Not too much though, it's a little, I don't care if I'm making a mess. I don't really care right now because this is history in the making. Right. See after you forget. It's much better. Like, look, this is a this is a proper pasta nest. It's proper, proper. I did sin. I'm so happy. All right. Stress me out last time because it's it's a long they long noodles long boys. Oh yeah. Oh.
my dad literally got me these pasta attachments for my mixer like two or three years ago and I rarely use them because I fucked up too many times. I would like to do this more often. Hi, Isa. Eid, how are you, Isa? It's still, it's not even sticky. I'm like, I think I'm like, I'm just, I'm being really generous with the flour, which I think is fine. Based on what I've seen like on videos, it's totally fine. You don't, the, the last thing you wanna do is have them stick together. All right. We get to do it again. Yeah. I'm having so much fun. I've never had this much fun in the kitchen. Ooh, you're, dude, I'm so, huh? What'd I say? What happened? Considering, oh, bye dark. I'm sorry. <laughs> good night, dark. I always miss it. I always miss dark's good night. You should do it, Raz. Don't be scared. If I can do it, you can do it. All right, why it is setting? There it is, fuck. Looking out, love you dark, sleep well. Oops. I didn't screw it in. Screw it in enough. That was a while ago. Thank you for the follow, by the way. Whatever that was. All right. Worn out. Earning this pasta. the final result because <laughs> don't worry <laughs> fine all right three such a perfect Last cut, enjoy it. Enjoy this last spaghetti cut. Have I really already been cooking for an hour and a half? It feels like five minutes. Like looking at the clock, holy crap. All right. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know about Sunshigasm. I think Sunshigasm will be animated if the time comes. All right, another, another good flower dusting. All right. Let's make sure these aren't sticking. Can you look up what, if I can put, if I'm supposed to put these in the fridge or what until they're ready? Cooked. And help me if I can should I just leave them out on the counter for a few like it's not gonna be that long but you know I mean I know what like 20 minutes can stuff so don't fuck with them. Hi 
Mike's dad. Oh my gosh. How are you? All right, I'm gonna move this out of the way now because I do plan on cooking it. Yeah. Alright, All right, it's floured nicely, I think. Huh? Here's the finished cut pasta. Is that pog? the flower is like in every little like gently manhandling it yeah, yeah. let me do it with my nice camera you're getting a picture of it pog pog pasta pog it looks good it's nothing like the last attempt i had um which was bad i can tell you that it was bad Hydrate. Cheers, Lone Star. Hi, King Dan. Hi, Code Monkey. Since I was distracted by my masterful pasta. All right, I'm gonna put this, put this, I'm gonna put it over here, just out of the way, like the heat kitchen. I don't want the heat. All right, so we're gonna, what should we do? Piccata will take like no time at all. It's gonna take like 10 minutes. So I think I can deal with my sushi bowl right now. Okay. So I have two cups of rice that have been cooling a little bit. Actually, I think nah, it's, it's still too hot. Okay. We're gonna do the piccata. Shit. Oh, I'm in a house. Yeah, this is our house. Thank you though, I love my kitchen. My favorite part of this house, I think. This is where Offical says needs an island. He said it. He said it. Um, all right, let's do a piccata. Let's just get that done, because this is the main event anyway. All right, so, piccata implies like lemon and capers. So that's what this is. We have, here, hopefully two nice fillets of tilapia. That is exactly what we have. Beautiful. All right. Two nice fillets. So we're going to take a little plate. Oh, hi. Thanks for checking in. I'm still a piece Strix, of Strix, thank you for the hugs. Thank you, thank you. I'm going to put these in here just for a moment. This is my cooked shrimp. I'm going to peel that later. Turn it out. It's fine. All right, we're going to rinse this out. Fishy. 
They say you're supposed to eat fish like once or twice a week, at least. Do you need those omegas? Those omega fatty acids and all that shit. bit of salt and pepper if I can find my salt thing. There it is. a light flour dredge. Just gotta cover it. This is what's gonna help us get a nice crust on our fish. Not a breading, just dredge. That right there. Do the same with the second filet. Make a little mess. We are pan frying, yes. Oh, me too, Stab. We almost got to see. Yeah, we. I didn't really get to see because some little fucking punk ass kid and his family kept standing in front of me, even though I was there first, screaming and putting their phones in my face. So I didn't really get to see. I was bitter. You can tell I'm a little upset about it. But they did start to butcher a fish in Osaka on the street. Super cool. Pulled that bad boy out. It's massive. It was like for a sushi restaurant. Like they were. All right. I've made my flour mess of the day. Ah. the rest of our ingredients prepared for our sauce. Well, actually, we'll do that after we... Okay, taking my skillet, I'm gonna add a good amount of olive oil. I wanna be careful, not too hot. I'm doing about medium heat. I'm gonna use a decent amount of olive oil because tilapia is very delicate, it's very light, and it will stick. So, you got enough to cook the entire pan. Nice little layer. Yo, hi Osborne. Yes, food. All that heat. I have garlic, I have lemons, I have chicken stock, I have heavy cream. 
Ooh, yeah, barbecue chicken is really good and it's very easy to make, I agree. I like stuff that tastes amazing and it wasn't a lot of hassle. This is one of those things that like, if you've got somebody coming over, you need to be pretend like you're fancy and shit. This is, this is one of those things, for sure. It's a little different than the one I've made, so I'm checking. Oh, we're actually adding a little bit of butter too. Whoops! Doesn't like pretend fancy. Hi, Bella. She thank you for the 25 biddies. True. There's real fancy. I mean, again, good cooking doesn't have to be that hard. To say it's pretend fancy is not really right to say. Honest. Just fancy. It doesn't have to be difficult. What's the, how, what's like, like, why are you fancy? Because I have fancy taste. stuff going. You only eat peel Dude, bro, you can't even peel grapes. What are you talking about peeled grapes? My god. All right. Get some lemon juice squeezed. I need my case. In my case. I know that the stove cam is a little we should we should do that. We should do some research. Just something we haven't done yet. Oh, we have another camera? Come on then. I got a new phone, DRM, so I haven't replaced the case yet. Wait, why am I not fancy? What happened? What's wrong with peel? Oh. <laughs> Bro, that's, that's next level. What don't you like about the peel? It's not, it's not even a peel. It's just part of the, that's like peeling strawberries, I feel like. Plus that's how you get like the snap, you know? out of here no pie today did we have pie before when was the last time we had pie all right check on our fish Show ya. 
some nice color. Just a little bit golden, nothing too crazy. Same thing on that side. Y'all are nuts. Nuts, I tell ya. Bonkers. All right, I'm saving the other half of this. It's about three, it's about three tablespoons, yeah. We don't want seeds, so fish those out. Dara, thank you for the sub gift to Lone Star. Thank you, sweetheart. You are so sweet. Grief. How many sub gifts is that? Oh, 285. Wow. All right. Got that. Lovely. Ninja, would you kindly open this bottle of wine? Please. for badges like that so just the way cup of chicken broth half a cup right. yeah no we can we can do better but Offical got this camera for us a long time ago we only we did only have one angle before. I think. Yeah, we I don't remember. God. The very first cookie streams were interesting. Are you sure you want me to oh you have to What? I hate this bottle. Yeah, I know. I forgot about this bit though, but that's not possible for us. I'm gonna, oh, I guess I should go ahead and get our water on the boil. fillets and fried fillets whatever you want to say and a nice size pot of water on to boil keep our lovely little drippings because that's good I'm gonna keep those let's wrap this way all right let's go ahead and make our sauce once the water boils Fresh pasta takes like no time. It takes like two to three minutes. That much I know. All right. We're gonna add another tablespoon of butter into the pan.
Actually, we're gonna add some garlic. Look at our garlic. Thanks, Belshevis. Mm hmm. It is called fun. Good job, Ninja. Ninja's been paying attention. lemon juice prepared. We have our heavy cream measured. We'll add our chicken broth. Oops. Our chicken broth. Um, yeah, we're getting there. We're almost to dinner time. I'm gonna wait a couple minutes. It's a lot of cloves. I love garlic too. I, I, I always go heavy handed on the garlic. Plus it's weak, it's weaker when it's like pre minced like that, so. Look, it's good, it's good, I promise. Measure garlic with your heart, not a recipe. Don't, don't let a recipe drag you down on garlic amounts, bruh. Don't do it. Too much garlic is just no, I so agree, I so agree. Raz, are you not a garlic lover? Because that makes me a little sad. Doing over here. Doing this. Maybe I want a glass. Maybe you don't want it warm. Um, I've heard that a like a humidifier will help because the stuff knows means you're like all dried up and swollen. So it's like taking a hot shower kind of. Alright. That's good. Add our cream. Add our lemon juice. And our cup of chicken broth. Plus it gets rid of all the extra. All right, now we're gonna bring that to a boil. Oh, hi, thanks for checking in. I'm still a piece of garbage. Oh, well, thank you for the host. Thank you, thank you. You, bro, don't, you're gonna implode the universe if you do that shit. Disco pants, maybe I'm going to the disco. Yeah, these are dancing pants. They're also falling down a little bit. It's too small. It's so tiny. That's a tiny poggers. It's like Googling Google, exactly. You'll break the internet. Don't do that. We got a little, a little string hanging down. <laughs> mm, this is gonna be so good. All right, I'm gonna go get my pasta because we have to admire pasta. A round of applause for what I have done here today. Well, I mean, we'll see. I guess we'll see when it's done cooking. But it looks really good. Nothing sticking. It's perfectly cut. Duck, duck, go. What? My goodness. Boiling 
to turn it down, I think. Really just let it simmer and just double check. I'm really good at second guessing myself. All right, cornstarch. Oh, thank you for my applause, biddies. Heck yeah. So I fucked up a little bit, but it's probably fine. Um, need to make a slurry. Cornstarch, it's not a big deal. What I'm gonna do is make separate slurry. Slurry is uh, a mixture of cornstarch and usually water. Very typical in like Asian cooking. Um, can add a bit of chicken broth. Get up and then add it in. I don't really know the reason why you're supposed to do it like this. But you don't want to just like add cornstarch into something to thicken it up. That's like a it's one of those like cooking myths. You have to do this first, otherwise it'll get like clumpy. All right. Then I'll take my whisk out. I have this. The peeler incident, I promise. All right, well, whatever. All right, so that's gonna thicken it up. Water, we're about to time this room. Lemon slice garnishes? Probably, right? Really just garnish. I'll use the other half of this. I like to do that. Really takes it takes it to the next level. Pretty thin though. This up top of the list. E sharp. excited about this pasta. I'm gonna go get my salt. Alexa, add kosher salt to my shopping list. I've added kosher shopping list. This shit almost empty. Wait a lot longer for it to fill. 
guys, we're about to have pasta. Fresh pasta. I'm breaking out my container. I don't want to wash the other one anyway. Can you look up how long to cook fresh spaghetti pasta? How many minutes? God, I want to fuck this up. I don't want to do it. I don't want to fuck it up. Actually, you know what? No, we're not going to shoot. I put it in the sauce. Yes. There's no salt in that. I'm just realizing, like, it's not even salted. They put I'm salting it. It'll thicken up a bit once I add the pasta too. You look up how many minutes? For fresh pasta. Then just not listening to me. Fine. Little taste. Mmm. Good. I got the capers, it'll be better. Lemony. Pasta. One to three minutes. It's gonna be fast. We're gonna be fast moving on this. My lord. I wanna make sure it's like. All right, salted. Gotta wait a couple more minutes. It's about to happen real fast. It's about to have dinner on the table. Yeah, no. I'm putting it in the sauce. I'm gonna scoop it out with my little spider. I don't. Is this technically a spider? I don't know. This. Hi, Miller. What vibes? What's up? Oh, Adam, Adam's family? I know you're talking. I'm like, I'm like not liking this, this viscosity. I'm gonna cook the noodles for like a minute and then they're gonna Almost there. Ew. I'm gonna cook all of it. Long noodles, very long. Big knife. Nah, it's a little knife. I've seen a big knife. I mean, shit. Knives are important, guys. They are. It's true. It's one of the most important cooking tools you can have. Next to like the right pots. Non-stick, non-stick skillet, like you know the kind of like sets they sell um, that are like pretty. Um, non-stick is just not. You don't get the same effect with a lot of stuff. They're good for like very specific things. Good. Very light. Watch 
pot never boils. True. Come on. <laughs> I don't. Hey, don't don't say that's a foe. I have a little. No, I'm not I'm gonna taste. It. It's got like a nice, like crusty, crunchy edge on it. It's good. Well cooked. It's well cooked. Alright, we're doing it. I've never been more excited than Exaggeration. Barely. Hot. Don't fuck with my pants, Tasty! Transfer me right in. Oh my god. The Almighty John, thank you for the follow. Oh my god. Papers. <laughs> I don't need your help. Oh, shit. Good amount of capers. And likes a lot of capers. Bye. 
Try to spoon. The recipe didn't call for pasta, but piccata is really necessary with pasta, and I just wanted to do it that way, so. The sauce on the fish will suffer a little bit. That's okay, because we have the sauce on the pasta. It'll be good. It'll be just fine. All right, let's do it. Guys, uh, we made fresh pasta and it looks edible. Uh. Yeah, if you don't like capers. Wait. Well, I don't know, capers. Yeah, we're not gonna have a lot of sauce, but that, that's okay. You know what, fuck it, it's fine. It's absolutely fine. That's what I'll do. Look at this fucking spaghetti. I made this homemade. I am officially a chef. True. Oh, for cool, thank you for the five dollars. Pasta dollars. Pasta. Pasta and peas. Love pasta and peas. Not gonna lie, that's delicious. All right, let's get a little bit of parsley garnish. Okay, we did it. All right, Ninja. Get in here. Garnish. Want to eat inside? That's fine, but they're mainly for garnish. I don't particularly like to eat them. Some people do. The culinary judge. I don't yeah, like garnish. Yeah, I can't yeah, yeah. Don't put something on my plate if I can't eat it. You can. All right, but otherwise, this looks really good. I'm gonna just try the fish first. Just Hold the on. fish. I wanna, I wanna save the pasta Ooh, for Ooh, nice. Look at that flake flaky. apart. Flake apart. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Mmm. Mmm. Very nicely cooked. Perfectly crisp skin. Yeah, you're right. But I know. <laughs> Tender inside. Mmm. Excellent. It's perfectly cooked. Moist, not dry at all, flaky outside. Perfect fish. Alright. I'm, go. I'm going I'm in so, for the pasta. I'm it looks good. It looks good. It looks really good. I'm all so right. excited. Alright. I'm so excited. Alright, give me that. I gotta know. I gotta know. Excellent. Did we do it? It's excellent. Oh my god, I did it. You did it. Oh my god, did I Perfectly do it? al dente. Delicious. Mmm. Much better than boxed pasta. So good. Wow. Wow. It's pasta. Excellent. Did we did it. We fucking did it. 11 out of 10. You made pasta. <laughs> Fuck making pasta by hand. Because the standing mixer did perfectly fine. Did excellent, in fact. So, fuck these pretentious people. It's so good. Can you get pasta? I've only had it at like certain restaurants, but it's a very different experience from box pasta. But it's really, good. it's silky, like it's mm -hmm. soft, it's tender, but in a good way. It's tender, but not overcooked. Like it's still al dente, but somehow also tender. Great. I'm so happy. Well done. Thank you. I'm so happy about it. These fucking lemons off my Look, that's what they say, all right? Oh my god. That's what they say to do with piccata, but I don't I don't get it either. 
the way I just have to move it around my plate. Same with this. Oh, I like parsley. A little bit. A little bit parsley. Well, that's just me, though. Now, I want my pasta. Well, Isa, look, I made it. If you have a stand mixer, if you have the attachment, you do have to have a lot of stuff. But you can buy, I mean, you can do it by hand and you can cut it by hand. Just a lot more work that way. The real test is going to be if you can repeat. I think I can. Did you get lucky or can you repeat it? No, I think I know what to do now. I get it now. I get it. I, I've, I'm here with it. I know what to do now. That's it? All right, guys. That's it. I gotta wait for this other stuff to cool and whatever, so fine. I'll take a picture of my meal prep later, but the main event is All right, guys, thank you so much. Oh, I'm so happy. Um, if you guys are new here and haven't already, uh, please join our Discord. I cook every Sunday. Um, hi, Ray Page, thank you. Um, tomorrow is Mellow Monday, which means chilling in marbles so I'll see you guys tomorrow for that and yeah thank you guys for the subs free subs donos sub gifts if you guys need to have already be sure to join the discord and all my socials and i'll see you guys tomorrow at five love you good night